welcome to another exciting episode of Small Blacks TV. What's that? Why is it exciting? Glad you asked. We have loads of All Blacks, Raga, and the one and only Noah. But it's not all about me. Although our Blackjack guest also starts with me. Check it out. He is the wonder from the Waikato and they call him Hunger. Let's welcome on in Liam Messon. Hey. <laughs> Thank you for coming on in. All good. Take a seat. Welcome to Black Jet. Now we want to take you back to 12 year old Liam Messon. 12 year old. Right, now you and your brother um, would get up in the morning, head to the kitchen, grab something to eat. What would, you, what would usually be the go for breakfast? Usually uh, whatever mum made. Yeah. So we'd wake up. If they're also mum, um, oh, I'd have to be pancakes. Ooh. Alright, Hunger, let's introduce you to uh, Mr. Dry Wheatbix once again. You ready to undertake the challenge? Yep. Alright. Yeah. Ready? Go. Three, Go two, time. one, oils. It's kind of like zoned out. Alright, we're going. Alright ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls watching at home, he's just put the last bit into his mouth. Here we go, now it's time to bring it on home. Here we go, come on. You've got a pretty good personal best, we want to beat that. Here we go. Bring Room's it on too hot, bro. Room's too hot. Okay, hang on, come on. Wait. Here we go. Let's, let's try this. What else is that doing? Come on. Is that helping? Yeah, yeah a little bit. Okay. What is it? Okay, here we go. Let's go. Let's bring it on home. Come on, I don't want to fan for nothing. Ah, oh, here we go. Stop the time. All right, let's go to the leaderboard. That's why they call him Hunger. Bumping Luatua into second place, Messam takes the top spot. Thanks for coming in, and we'll catch you next time again here on Black Chat. Thanks, guys, and great effort on the wheat picks, Liam. Gee. That boy can eat! <laughs> While we're on the subject, how about we learn how to do a chip kick? <laughs> Get it? Eat chip. Eat chip. <laughs> Roll the tape. You get it, eh? You get it? Welcome to All Black Skills. Today, we're going to teach you the chip kick with my good man, Nua. I thought I'm quick. Chip kick. Not potato chips. Oh, uh huh. Uh, maybe after. <laughs> okay, you stand there. Chip kick. Chip kick. You think you got this? Got it. Intercept. <laughs> Try. So obviously we want to get the ball over the opponent's head. Okay, so there's a bit of space in behind the opposition yeah. and you want to be kicking the ball into that space. So you don't want to be kicking the ball uh, too high or too far. Uh, so it's important that in this case, you don't have a big follow through, okay? So yeah. you don't want to be kicking the ball too, too, too high. high. Okay, so it's just a nice little snap of the foot. Okay, it's a nice little snap. Snap. You can just practice by going like this, just to get the, get the feel of the, uh, the ball on the foot. The, Less time you have on the ball, your foot, the uh, more spring it will get. Okay, so I'm just gonna get you to do it. Okay, back. Oh, and the catch! I learned that one from Izzy. Yeah, that was good. Was it? Yeah, the catch. Shot. We'll finish the lesson right there. Last time we saw Rugger, he was in the mighty fine South Island paradise of Nelson. Did you guess that? Well, see if you know where he is this week. And I'll give you a clue. It's not Nelson. This week, Rugger has travelled over the Auckland Bridge to a place over 200,000 people call home. Its stadium at Albany hosts All Blacks games and is also the home of the Harbour Master. Do you know where Rugger is? Well, if you do, then text the place name to 4888. And kids, Ask a grown up first. Hey team, Professor DAWG coming at you from the SBTV Science Laboratory. 
giving you the skinny on questions like these. Hi Azzy, my name's Speed and I'm 10 years old. My question is, how do energy drinks work? Now that's a great question, because I like a good energy drink. These drinks work in three ways. They rehydrate you, which is just the fancy word of saying they stop you from being thirsty. Secondly, when you exercise, you sweat. Your sweat has salt in it. If you don't believe me, try licking your arm the next time you exercise. The salt is called electrolyte, and energy drinks will often have electrolyte. Finally, the drinks have a lot of sugar called carbohydrate. Small blacks don't really exercise hard enough to need an energy drink. A glass of water or an orange should be fine. Maybe a lolly if you're tired of your bedroom. I used to have an energy drink if I wanted to stay up and watch the All Blacks play. Once, stayed up a whole week, watched two games. Don't do that at home though, kids. I think it's time for Rugger Tales. One, two, three, let's go Shabby! Oh, deep breaths, oh, it'll be okay. William, what's wrong? Go to sleep. That's the problem, I can't sleep. I'm too nervous about tomorrow's game. You don't need to be nervous, William, you'll be great. You just have to be super confident, like me. I get nervous every time I put my boots on, and sometimes I put them on the wrong feet. What's all the chatter chatter about in here? It's the middle of the night. It's a quarter past seven, Grandad. William can't sleep because he's nervous about the game tomorrow, and I was telling him to forget nerves and be confident. Well, Alice, let's just imagine if we weren't nervous at all. OK, team, how are we feeling today? It's a big game, so control your nerves. I'm not nervous at all, coach. We'll thrash them. It's going to be too easy. Yeah, coach. They'll be lucky to get second today. I'm so calm, I feel like I could just go for a nice nap before we start. And what about you, Web? Web? Oh, oh, yeah, I, I feel fantastic. Uh, just resting my eyelids and saving energy, coach. OK, uh, good. Now time to switch on. All in. One, two, three, let's go rugby! I'll catch this. They may as well put five points on the scoreboard now. Oh, that was strange. I normally never miss those. Don't be too sure of yourself, young lady. Concentrate. Don't worry, coach. We're way better than this team. A little fiend here, and I should score for sure. Oh, how good am I? Oh. Crikey, William. You've got teammates for a reason. Use them. Lucky they have me here. I've got hands like glue. Oh. Uh. Wow, I sucked. Yeah, I was pretty confident about that catch. And I wasn't nervous at all. Not that it helped me much. Well, my little rugabies, I think therein lies the problem. When you're too confident, you get cocky, sloppy, lazy. <coughs> Nerves are a good thing because they help you concentrate. Let's have another look, shall we? OK, team, how are we feeling? My tummy feels a bit funny, coach. I think I've got a bug. Me too, coach. I'm not sure I want to play. OK, you four, listen up and listen good. This isn't a dodgy mince pie in your tummy. It's butterflies, and they're a good thing. All in. One, two, three, let's go rugabies! Hey, rugger? Yes, Webb? How did coach know I had butterflies for lunch? Webb? You have to stop eating insects before the game, or you really will have a tummy bug. <laughs> Woohoo! Now that's more like it. Now, children, what did we learn from our little game? That everyone gets nervous, even all blacks. And they keep us alert, and we play better. Butterflies in my tummy are a good thing. And tasty too. Mmm, butterflies. Ah. And it's my 